Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, let's check Pet Ranch, new in-game feature of Lost Ark. As you can see, I'm already in the game here in my stronghold. You can see here in the left upper corner, level of my stronghold is 51, which is actually more than enough to get a pet range. So let's talk first with this NPC, Adeline. We need to talk with this NPC actually to get specific uh, quest. This is a pet range quest. Let's check it out. So let's finish uh, first uh, this quest. Uh, here we have a few items. We have here jam cookie. You will be able to later to exchange this uh, item for various items. And also we have here pet expertise potion. Nice. Let's accept the quest. Okay, so this quest will take me to other parts of the island. Let's check it out. Actually, I need to move to the Stronghold Farm. Let's go there now. To see what is happening there. So this is one a new, very interesting in-game feature. Because uh, check a guide actually from previous week. We have get a very interesting guide from Amazon Games regarding Pet Ranch. Where you are able to see that uh, pet ranch and actually pets can be very useful you can get uh, pet skill okay where is that npc it's here in front of me so you can see here my position now on the map i'm here in the lower part of map of my stronghold let's check it out okay Let's talk with this NPC. Come on, G, okay. F5, read the Vern Magic Society notice. Let's read it. So here we have details regarding Pet Ranch. I will not go into details regarding this right now. I will not read to you this. Let's play actually. Let's talk with this NPC again. So each pet have its own morale, yes. You'll see that a little bit later. Okay, let's check it out. Looking really good, right? So let's talk with this npc again come on ready and this is end of this quest i have get some jam cookies and pet expertise potion also some experience let's take it thank you let's go further pet ranch unlocked so this is how you unlock actually your pet ranch right you need to move to your stronghold talk with that first npc adeline take this quest and move here to talk with the second NPC and you will have this feature of the game unlocked. Let's enter here pet range. I have here, let's check it out. Uh, there are a few NPCs here. We have here pet management. Let's check it out, this NPC. So I can put here my pet as you can see. Okay, I can retrain, upgrade, change pet skill. Very useful thing, right, also. Regarding pet upgrade, you can see here on this part of the user interface, with upgrading your pet, you will get one random pet skill, which you can later change, right? That's not a problem. Grant access to pet inventory expansion, grant access to pet reskinning, and stronghold dispatch effect. So it's absolutely worth to upgrade your pet. To upgrade your pet, you will need pet growth token, mysterious enchanted token produced by the Vern Magical Society used when upgrading pets. So I think situation is clear regarding that, absolutely. You can, like I said, change pet skill later, then you will have it and you can retrain your pet also if you want, as you can see. So let's check other NPCs, let's leave. Then we have this NPC here. So this NPC, as you can see here, you can exchange different kind of report items for a Vita Meows. Yes, you can see here, you can do that. In exchange, you will get a Vita Meows. Let's take one Vita Meow, just for fun. Actually 20. 
Okay, you have get a Wita Meow. Let's check now inventory. What are you actually getting with this Wita? What are you actually getting with this Wita Meow item? Where is it? Okay, here we go. Wita Meow. Vitamin that gives vitality to pets. Recover 10% of morale for pets that take it. So you're recovering that morale which you are spending while your pets on your pet ranch are actually producing that jam cookies, right? So we have here jam cookie. Also, let's check two other NPCs here. First, we have here this NPC which will actually take your pet to the different kind of part of the ranch. So you have two parts of the pet ranch. You have an actual ranch and cookie workshop. You can place your pet in either of those, right? So let's place pet here, for example. And here your pet will produce cookies. So here in this part of the pet ranch in cookie workshop, after you place your pet here, it will produce cookies. However, your morale will decrease with time, right? And when your morale will be low, then you need to move your pet here in the ranch part where your morale will increase again, right? So we can do that. Actually, I have full morale of uh, my pet, this one, right? So no need to do that. Let's go back to cookie workshop and let's place my pet here. You have two parts actually of the pet ranch. One part is called cookie workshop where you will produce cookies and where you will actually spend your morale. And you have this part called the ranch where you will be able to increase your morale again to maximum and return your pet back to cookie workshop. That is the basic system, right? And later you can exchange your cookies for different kind of rewards. Here we have rewards. So let's check what kind of rewards can you actually get in exchange for jam cookies. Here we have first reward, the pet sitter chest contains useful items to take care of pets, exchange for cookies at the cookie workshop. Then we have here pet expertise potion, one very important item, a potion for pets produced by the Vern Magic Society used to increase pets expertise from the pet inventory. Yep. Pet Inventory Expansion Ticket. Pet Inventory Expansion Ticket issued by Rare Magic Society used to increase pet inventory slots for legendary pets. Nice. Then we have here Pet Customization Potion. Use it on a legendary pet in your pet inventory with its reskin feature locked to change its appearance. Interesting. Then we have here some Headwear Chest. Interesting. Let's go forward. Lots of rewards actually you can see here. We have here some skins. Okay, let's go forward. Let's see what else do we have here. And also we have... Oh, this one is looking interesting, right? Hoodie. Okay. Then we have here Phoenix Plum. And we have a legendary card pack and Soul Leaf. So you can exchange gem cookies for these different kind of rewards with this NPC here, right? So this is the main basic system regarding pet ranch. Let's check a little bit how it's looking. Okay. So Lost Ark is a beautiful game. You already know that from before. It's looking really nice. <laughs> oh, look at this. So my two pets, right, are now spending their energy. Morale, actually, right? Look at this. Poor Bunny and Dreaming Moko. They are running here. They will be very tired, right? And when they spend their morale, you need to move them to the ranch part to gain their morale back, right? So, so this is a basic gameplay system and rewards which you can get from Pet Ranch. Don't forget about skills of your pet. You can check dedicated video on my YouTube channel just about that from like seven days ago. Because like I said, from Amazon Games, we have get a very interesting guide regarding Pet Ranch about maybe six or seven days ago. Check details over there regarding different kind of skills for your pet. In the future, of course, when I see something interesting is happening with Lost Ark, I will let you know about that. I'm also playing Lost Ark over there in Korea. And when I see something interesting is happening regarding new classes or some new in-game features, I will let you know about that because sooner or later, probably later, whatever they have over there in Korea, we will also get here in the West. Next, a new class of Lost Ark we will get here in September. That will be Scouter. For a list of that class, I will make some dedicated guides. I already made one guide regarding Scouter, but for a list of that class, like I said, I will make more videos regarding skills and generally about that class.
Let me know in the comments below video how do you like a new in-game feature of Lost Stark Pet Ranch. If you are interested into MMORPGs, check my YouTube channel for lots of gameplay videos, guides, news and reviews from world of MMORPG gaming with main focus on a new upcoming PC MMORPGs. Thank you for watching the video and subscribe to my YouTube channel to see more MMORPG videos and of course Lost Ark videos in the future. See you soon.